This is Arden Dawn 55 and I'm going to be reviewing the 3D Connecticon Space Navigator. I got it on eBay, shipped to me for $90. It's $100 on their website. I use it for DAS 3D and Blender and Google Earth. It comes in this plastic box thing here, which I've already been using it for a couple months. So. Uh, it has this manual thing, which I haven't even opened up yet. The yeah. information written in another language. Also comes with this little notebook. This is the English manual. And it comes with the installation CD, which I think is right over here. Also comes with the installation CD. It has some like puzzle games used with a 3D mouse. It has training, like a three level simple training thing of just how to use the mouse so you match up the object with where it tells you to. And it's pretty simple. And then it has all, I guess you'd call them drivers for all the programs, so it runs them all. This is the mouse itself. It lights up blue uh, when you plug it in and use it. It plugs in USB. And the way it works is, there's a, it's pretty heavy, it's weighted on the bottom. It's logo and stuff on the bottom. And the where the USB comes out, that is the front. So whenever you're using it, you're going to want to have this pointing towards the computer. And it pulls up, down, side to side, tilt, both sides, or all sides. So, yeah, it's um, easy to navigate your 3D world once you get used to it. And then... You have a button you can macro on this side. I use it for delete in DAS Studio. And then on your left side, it opens up the options menu. You might be able to macro this button too, but I leave it to open up the options menu. It saved me a ton of time and work because I'm just starting with 3D stuff so I don't use a lot of keyboard. I use more simple stuff and so it helps me save a lot of time. It's also nice because when you're using Dash Studio you can be doing two things at once because you can be spinning with your mouse and manipulating the object with the other mouse. You can also zoom into PDF files with it and scroll up and down. It's not that useful and it's kind of useless for that, but it can. It's a good mouse and saved me a lot of time. Um, I would buy it again because it saved me so much time. Like I didn't really want to spend $90 on it, but it's helped a lot. And it was worth it for what I'm doing. So, yep, that's it.